Electric vehicles, or EVs, have taken the spotlight in the automotive world over the past decade as people seek solutions to address climate-related issues. In 2023, electric car sales surged as more individuals opted for eco-friendly energy alternatives. But what if the future of automobiles extends beyond electric engines? Today, we'll explore the ambitious plans of major auto manufacturers that may eventually relegate electric engines to the background. The electric vehicle market is growing rapidly and evolving quickly. In 2022, global sales of electric vehicles, or EVs, reached 10 million units, a substantial 55% increase from 2021. This growth highlights a strong focus on sustainability, driven by governments and consumers alike who aim to reduce carbon emissions. Many countries are imposing strict emissions regulations and offering significant incentives to promote EV adoption. For instance, the European Union plans to phase out gasoline and diesel engines by 2035. Countries like Norway and the Netherlands lead in EV sales, benefiting from generous tax breaks and rebates. These policies have helped drive sales and foster consumer confidence in making the switch to electric vehicles. Looking ahead, EV sales are expected to continue rising, with forecasts indicating strong growth in the coming years. Experts predict that by 2030, electric vehicles could make up a substantial portion of global car sales, thanks to ongoing technological advancements, supportive government policies, and changing consumer preferences. With the rise of electric vehicles, major automakers such as General Motors, Toyota, and BMW are exploring other technologies. You might wonder why they are pursuing alternative innovations. Some of the reasons may surprise you and leave you convinced. With electric engines, range anxiety is a significant concern for many people when it comes to purchasing electric vehicles. Consumers often worry that an EV won't travel far enough on a single charge, especially for long trips. Although battery technology has improved, potential buyers are still concerned about running out of power in areas where charging stations are scarce. This worry influences their decisions, prompting car manufacturers to explore alternative options, such as hydrogen fuel cells and hybrid vehicles, which can offer longer driving ranges and faster refueling. Having an adequate number of charging stations is crucial for the success of electric vehicles. Unfortunately, in many areas, especially rural or less populated regions, there aren't enough charging options for these vehicles. It's unreasonable to expect people with limited access to charging stations to choose EVs for their daily transportation. To address this issue, major automakers are exploring alternatives that require less charging infrastructure, such as hydrogen-powered vehicles, which can be refueled in about the same time as traditional gasoline cars. Additionally, the production of lithium-ion batteries used in electric engines raises serious environmental and ethical concerns. Mining for lithium, cobalt, and nickel, the key components of these batteries, can be harmful to the environment and poses health risks to people living in mining regions. Car companies recognize these challenges and are investing in research on different battery technologies, such as solid-state batteries, which use more abundant and less controversial materials. Some companies are also working on ways to recycle materials from old batteries to reduce their environmental impact. When car manufacturers explore options beyond electric vehicles, it reflects their efforts to address consumer concerns, adapt to infrastructure limitations, and tackle ethical issues related to current battery technology. This diversified approach will help them remain competitive in a changing market while working toward sustainability. Hydrogen fuel cells are among the top technological innovations developed by major auto companies as an alternative to electric engines. You might be wondering, how does this work? Hydrogen fuel cells are devices that can convert hydrogen gas into electricity. They function by combining hydrogen and oxygen in a chemical reaction, producing only water vapor as a byproduct. Unlike batteries which store electricity, hydrogen fuel cells generate electricity continuously as long as they have a supply of hydrogen. This technology offers a sustainable energy solution, allowing vehicles to travel long distances without the need for large charging stations, like those required by battery electric vehicles. With their high energy, density, and fast refueling times, hydrogen fuel cells are an attractive option for transportation. In recent years, major car companies such as BMW, Toyota, and Honda have made significant progress in developing hydrogen-powered vehicles. 
BMW has been involved in hydrogen engine development for some time, with projects like the iHydrogen NEXT concept car and the 1 Series fuel cell hybrid electric vehicle. In 2021, the German auto giant announced that their next focus would be on an all-hydrogen version of the BMW X5. Another notable example is Toyota's Mirai, which the company claims can travel over 400 miles on a single tank of hydrogen. This impressive range, combined with refueling times of less than 5 minutes, makes hydrogen fuel cells vehicles a compelling alternative to traditional gasoline cars and battery electric vehicles. In 2023, sales of hydrogen fuel cell vehicles increased by 30%, indicating a growing interest in this technology. And you should consider it too. As an evolving technology, hydrogen fuel cells face some challenges. The number of hydrogen refueling stations remains limited compared to the vast network of electric vehicle charging stations available today. Additionally, producing hydrogen can be very energy intensive and often relies on fossil fuels. However, exciting developments are underway in the production of green hydrogen. This process uses renewable energy sources, such as wind and solar, to extract hydrogen from water. This method makes hydrogen production more sustainable and helps reduce the carbon footprint of traditional methods. Let's talk about compressed air engines, a promising innovation from major auto companies. How do these work? Before we dive in, take a moment to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Alright, compressed air engines use high pressure air to generate mechanical power. When air is released from a storage tank, it expands and flows into cylinders. This movement pushes pistons or turbines, creating motion that powers vehicles or machines. Unlike traditional engines that burn fuel, these engines harness the energy from expanding air. The technology is both clean and renewable since it produces no harmful emissions and relies solely on air. Many companies are developing compressed air vehicles, with MDI or Moteur Développement International leading the way. MDI has built several prototypes to demonstrate that compressed air can be a practical means of powering vehicles. One significant advantage of these vehicles is their quick refueling time. MDI claims they can be refueled in just three minutes, making them as convenient as gasoline engines. MDI asserts that its compressed air vehicles can be fully refueled in just three minutes, significantly reducing downtime and enhancing consumer usability. Compressed air engines offer some impressive benefits. They are lightweight and produce no harmful emissions during operation, making them ideal for city travel, where air quality is a priority. Additionally, their simple design may reduce maintenance costs since they have fewer moving parts compared to traditional combustion engines. However, several challenges hinder the widespread adoption of compressed air technology. One major issue is range. Vehicles powered by compressed air typically cannot travel as far as those using gasoline or batteries. This means they require more frequent refueling on long trips, which can be inconvenient. Moreover, advancements in air storage and efficiency are necessary to make compressed air engines more practical and competitive in today's automotive market. While compressed air engines show promise as an eco-friendly alternative, significant efforts from major auto companies are still needed to make them a viable option for everyday use in the near future. Moving on, we have solar-powered engines. But what does this mean for vehicles? Solar-powered vehicles use clean energy by converting sunlight into electricity through special panels called photovoltaic cells. These cells, typically made of silicon, absorb sunlight and produce direct current or DC electricity. This modern mode of transportation aims to reduce fossil fuel consumption and decrease greenhouse gas emissions. Although solar vehicles have been around since the late 1900s, recent advancements in solar technology and battery efficiency are making them more practical for everyday use. Top companies in the solar vehicle field, such as Lightyear, are developing designs that allow vehicles to charge while in motion. This innovation could revolutionize the automotive industry by reducing or potentially eliminating the need for regular charging stations. For instance, Lightyear's latest model is designed to harvest enough energy from its solar panels to cover typical daily trips, offering a range of 800 kilometers on a sunny day. 
But what are the key features of this technology? Firstly, the design includes sleek solar panels integrated into the car's surface, maximizing sunlight absorption. Additionally, the new battery technology ensures that energy collected on sunny days can be stored for use when the weather is less favorable. However, despite these promising advancements, solar vehicles still face significant challenges that must be addressed before they can become widely adopted. Firstly, current solar cells only convert a small fraction of sunlight into usable energy. As efficiency improves, vehicles will be able to capture more energy, enhancing their performance. Additionally, the high cost of producing advanced solar panels and vehicle systems can be a barrier. While the initial price may deter buyers, costs are gradually decreasing as technology advances. Integrating solar panels adds weight to vehicles, which can affect overall performance, and incorporating solar technology into car designs increases their complexity. Nevertheless, experts believe these challenges can be overcome. Breakthroughs in materials such as lighter and more efficient solar cells and improved batteries are making it easier to create practical solar-powered vehicles. Another grand plan from these auto giants is the introduction of water-powered engines. Water-powered engines are an exciting way to generate energy using water as fuel. The core idea involves electrolysis, a process that breaks down water, or H2O, into hydrogen and oxygen. Once separated, hydrogen can be used as a clean fuel for engines or fuel cells, producing energy while only releasing water vapor as a byproduct. Although still largely in the testing phase, some companies are making progress in water-powered technology. Among them is water fuel, which has been developing prototypes aimed at transforming how cars consume energy. These engines operate on the premise that hydrogen from water can replace traditional fossil fuels. So, what are the key innovations here? First, scientists are working to improve the electrolysis process, which is crucial to making water-powered engines practical. Additionally, new methods of storing hydrogen are being explored to ensure the fuel can be safely transported and used in vehicles. Early tests indicate that water-powered engines could deliver fuel efficiency comparable to that of regular gasoline engines, making them a promising alternative for the automotive industry. However, for water-powered engines to become mainstream, significant challenges remain, especially regarding the efficiency and cost of the electrolysis process. Current methods consume a substantial amount of energy, which can impact the overall sustainability of the technology. Nevertheless, as research continues, new materials and energy systems may make this clean energy source more viable. As for potential developments, innovations like catalysts that enhance the electrolysis process, or techniques such as photoelectrochemical water splitting could significantly improve performance. Moreover, combining water-powered engines with renewable energy sources like solar or wind for electrolysis could increase sustainability and reduce reliance on fossil fuels. The automotive industry is undergoing a major shift as leading companies compete to dominate alternative energy sources. Companies like GM are not just focusing on electric vehicles, they're also investing in hydrogen fuel cells and other emerging technologies. This broad approach highlights the urgency for these companies to adapt to consumer demands and comply with new government regulations. GM has pledged an impressive $35 billion to develop electric and hydrogen vehicles by 2025. This demonstrates their strong commitment to leading the way in environmentally friendly transportation. This investment encompasses research, development, and the production of new vehicle models, positioning GM as a frontrunner in the race for sustainable cars. In addition to fierce competition, the automotive industry is witnessing increased collaboration between car manufacturers, tech companies, and research institutions. These partnerships aim to combine resources and expertise, enabling faster innovation and more effective solutions to challenging problems, such as improving battery technology and developing sustainable production methods. For example, companies are collaborating to advance self-driving technology, integrate artificial intelligence, and enhance battery efficiency. All of these elements are critical to the future success of vehicles. These partnerships often involve joint research projects, technology sharing, and cooperative ventures to reduce costs and expedite product development. But what do consumers really want? As technology evolves, consumer preferences change as well. 
Many consumers are seeking alternatives to electric vehicles, especially if these options perform equally well or even better. A survey found that 65% of consumers are willing to try hydrogen or solar-powered vehicles if they become widely available. However, education is crucial to help consumers embrace these alternatives. When people understand how these technologies work and the benefits they offer, their attitudes can shift, leading to greater demand. If you found this video interesting and want to see more content like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next video. See you next time.